A glamorous jury presided over by Oscar-winning director of the artist Michelle Hassanovicius has opened Deauville's famed American Film Festival. Kicking off the event, actress Laura Dern was presented with a special tribute. Over a 30-year career, the Oscar-winning actress and frequent David Lynch collaborator has worked with some of the greatest film directors. She says the secret to success is to never stop taking on new challenges. You know, it seems to continue to start over and over and over and over. Because if you want to be an actor, you hope to continue to reinvent through character and have self-discovery be part of the art. So uh, I think it's just beginning. In the wake of recent attacks, the small French seaside town was under extra tight security for the 43rd edition of the event. A total of 14 films are competing for the top prize at the Deauville Film Festival this year. A rich selection reflecting the diversity and creativity of contemporary American cinema. From Hollywood blockbusters, to smaller budget independent movies. Another guest of honor was British actor Robert Pattinson, who, according to Deauville tradition, was given his very own beach locker room. He took his time signing the famous Golden Book to the cries of delighted fans. I've been intending to come to Deauville for, um, I think, four years or something and then to suddenly come and have this kind of amazing honor I'm kind of stunned I don't really know what to make of it but uh, it's amazing next you're incredible do you understand yeah. I'm serious you think I could have done that without you standing next to me being strong are you feeling this are you feeling because I'm feeling right now yeah I'm cold you're cold yeah let's get to Virginia man Keep your head now. Turn around. He's all right. We didn't throw oh. Pattinson recently worked with relative rookie directors, the Safdie brothers. We wanted to make a piece of pulp, something that felt dangerous, uh, uh, you know, a, a modern-day neo-noir, a, a neo-grindhouse film, and we and we, we wanted to make a ref basically reflect society back onto itself. And America, you know, say what you want, it's a land of, of incredible possibilities, but it's also pretty dark right now. And the reflection that you're seeing is just a reflection of the darkness. Also gracing Deauville's Promenade des Planches, France's version of the Hollywood Walk of Fame, was A-lister Jeff Goldblum, who turned up with his family for the occasion. Asked about the secret of his happiness, the notoriously jovial Goldblum, for whom acting as a childhood dream come true, said the answer was simple. I do practice, and it's not hard for me, as you can imagine, to practice a kind of daily and active gratitude. I kind of do remind myself what I'm very thankful for, you know. I feel unbelievably, miraculously lucky to have gotten a chance to do this at all and to keep getting chances for a few decades, you know, and to work with the good people. That's, um, a, a, a day doesn't go by where I don't thank my lucky stars. Je pense à Fernande, je bande, je bande, je pense à Felicie, je bande aussi, je pense à Lina. The winners of the Deauville Film Festival will be announced on September the 9th. Je ne bande plus, les bandes en papa ne se commandent pas.